Today you will learn about failing retaining walls. As a homeowner or property owner, should you fix, replace, or completely tear down that failing or leaning retaining wall you have? Your retaining wall is starting to give up on life. It looks sad, it's no longer straight, but bowed outwards towards that hillside. Maybe it's cracking or even crumbling. What should you do? Should you fix it, replace it, or just tear it down and not have to worry about it anymore? You know, out of sight, out of mind, right? Today we'll be discussing each of these options so that you can make an informed decision with your particular situation. Fixing your retaining wall would usually be the cheapest way to still have a retaining wall. It kinda depends on the situation, but in most cases, you'd want to add either vertical piers or horizontal tiebacks, or even a combination of the two to add vertical and lateral support to the wall in the position it currently sits. The goal of this repair would be to stabilize the wall from any movement again in the future, but not necessarily help to move or rotate that wall if it's already began to lean. If a retaining wall has stair stepping or spiderweb cracks everywhere, we're looking at a much different repair that will involve cutting out that area of the wall, excavating the soils on the back side of that wall, and replacing that area of the wall together. With the labor involved with replacing sections of retaining wall, it can become pretty dang pricey. If fixing a retaining wall isn't a good option, replacement may be a more cost-effective route depending on the design requirements of that new retaining wall. In many cases, the new design will include vertical piers or tiebacks to properly and adequately support the wall for years to come. So now that you know the three options available for fixing a failed retaining wall, it's time to decide the best course of action for your situation. Most situations don't require immediate attention, but the longer someone waits, the more expensive it usually costs to perform those repairs. When you're ready for concrete numbers for repairs for your situation, fill out a contact form on our website or call our office directly and we'll put you in contact with one of our project design specialists. Thanks for watching the video and remember to never settle for a failed or leaning retaining wall.